Hello, you are welcome. How to solve this system of equation? Here we are finding the value of x and y. Let's label this as equation 1 and here as equation 2. From equation 1, we have x plus y equals to 6. Make y the subject of formula here. That is, take x to that side. We now have y equals to 6 minus x. Now, from equation 2, we have x, y equals to 6. Let's substitute the value of y here in equation 2. And equation 2 will become x multiplied by 6 minus x, then equals to 6. So this x can open this bracket and we will have 6x minus x squared equals to 6 when we rearrange from here and bring 6 to this side we have minus x squared plus 6x minus 6 equals to 0 and let's remove this minus here and multiply through by minus and this become x squared minus 6x plus 6 which is equal to 0 and we have a quadratic equation here then we can solve for x using the quadratic formula here we have a to be 1 we have b to be minus 6 and we have c to be 6 so using the quadratic formula x will then be equals to minus b that's minus minus 6 plus or minus square root of b square that's minus 6 square then minus 4 ac that's 1 times 6 then over 2 times 1 that's 2a then from here we have x to be equals to minus times minus that's plus that's 6 plus or minus square root of we have minus c square that's 86 then minus 4 times 6 that's 24 over 2 and uh, this gives us x equals to 6 plus or minus square root of 12 over 2. And we can separate 12 as 4 times 3. And this is equals to x equals to 6 plus or minus square root of 4 times 3 over 2. And square root of 4 is 2. We take it out. And we have x to be equals to 6 plus or minus 2 root 3 over 2. And which we can separate as x equals to 6 over 2 plus 2 root 3 over 2. And 2 plus or minus. And here we can reduce this. And x will now be equals to 3 plus or minus root 3. So we have two possible cases here. The first we have x equals to 3 plus root 3. And next we also have x equals to 3 minus root 3. And from here we have the value of x. Then also we can get the value of y using the equation we have that is y equals to 6 minus x. And from here, this will become y will now be equals to 6 minus into bracket 3 plus root 3. Then, close bracket, minus open bracket here, we have y equals to 6 minus 3 minus root 3. Then we have y equals to 6 minus 3 here is 3 minus root 3. Then we have x comma y from here is solution we have x equals to so x comma y from here we have it to be equals to 3 plus root 3 then comma y that's 3 minus root 3 then on this side as well we saw or y from y equals to 6 minus x 
then we have y equals to 6 minus into bracket 3 minus root 3 then minus open bracket as well we have y equals to 6 minus 3 then plus root 3 so we have y equals to 3 plus root 3 then from here x comma y from here will be equals to the first value of x here we have the value of x here we have 3 minus root 3 so this gives us 3 minus root 3 comma y and that is 3 plus root 3 then when we look at this solution we have the value of x here is the value of y a and the value of y a is the value of x a so we have these two set of solutions in this problem then we can check from what we have from equation one we have x plus y equals to six so let's use this first solution to see if x plus y is equal to six from here we have three plus root three then plus three minus root three is this equals to 6 from here then we have plus root 3 minus root 3 cancel out then 3 plus 3 that's 6 which is equals to 6 then also from equation 2 we have x y equals to 6 that is the product of x and y should give us 6 let's multiply this now and see whether we have in 6 there so we have 3 plus root 3 multiply by 3 minus root 3 now from here is this equals to 6 when we expand this from difference of 2 square these are conjugate sort then this gives us 3 square minus root 3 square from here square we cancel square root 3 square is 9 minus 3 is this equals to 6 of course 9 minus 3 here is 6 which is equals to 6 and we have therefore the solution to this problem is given as this which is 3 plus root 3 comma 3 minus root 3 or we have 3 minus root 3 comma 3 plus root 3 thank you for watching please subscribe to this channel give maximum reaction comment share and uh, likes Thank you for watching. See you next class and God bless you.